Hi, I am Dr. Bhumika Batra, founder of Ed Bhumi Learning Private Limited. I hope you all are doing pretty well today. I came up with this video to share about our recent experience with the article publication. Predatory and cloned publishing has become an organized industry. In addition, the fake journals, there are now fake conferences too. The highest contribution to fake journals come from India, followed by Nigeria and Turkey. So this time our experience is with the Journal of Positive School Psychology. Whenever we plan to publish our research paper in any journal, what is the first step we do? We Google about it, right? So the same manner we have to. So first we went to the SJR website and we found that this journal is under the category of Q2 Scopus. And same we have checked in the scopus.com as well. Yes, this journal is right there. So these two parts are most important that to check on SJR website and to check on Scopus, right? I think the information we get from there are sufficient enough to know that we can publish our paper there. What is stopping us now? One part, check the contact details. Second part, if someone who is helping you to get it published, make sure what it states. If, it, if he or she is saying that your paper will get published in 10 days or in 30 days or 15 days and so on. So that is the major point of concern whether where we are sending our paper is the right or not. So in order to check this, what we have done, I'll tell you now. So I've started Google about it. Google is the major source from where we can get any sort of information. So amazingly, I found one of the paper titled Study of the Causes and Consequences of Clone Journal Publications, which is published with the Springer in July 2022. This paper is totally based upon a case study for this particular journal where we were planning to share our paper. So the two major missed points I found in that article are that one side they have written that they will publish only twice a year it, to the another part on the same web page they have written the frequency is monthly and you know now this paper is July 2022 published of course the screenshot was also taken from July and now it's September 29 2022 if I'm checking their website they have also corrected this miss point first part so apart from this article, I also found some few major points on Twitter. I just searched with Journal of Positive School Psychology on Twitter and I got various other points along with the website and the issues they have published. Whatever I am speaking now, I will also paste the screenshot right after this video. You can please have a look and be informed third part is the title of the journal. The title is Journal of Positive School Psychology and when I'm checking its issues released already. So they are more of mass media, e-learning, medicine, Islamic law, constitutional system, bidden administration and so on. So I don't think so that Journal of Positive School Psychology by the name it looks multidisciplinary, of course not. So the information shared today verbally and through screenshots, I think is sufficient to make a wise decision for your publication in future. Do not just send your research paper anywhere in sake for the publication. 
google it research it very well that you will get to know whether it's a clone predatory or a real one if you like this video kindly spread among your colleagues thank you for watching us goodbye